Hello everybody, welcome to Blood Bowl Super League, uh, well Blood Bowl 3 Super League Week 1, Group B. We've got, you know, one of the matches of the tournament here, we've got Artemis Black, a big streamer, versus Andy Davo, a big streamer and YouTuber, absolutely glorious to see these two guys. Um, if we take away the colours, we can see that Art has gone green-white with a red logo, like Wales, and... Uh, Davo's gone blue blue and purple. This is actually a pretty good... You can tell that Davo spent a lot of time customising teams. Cause this, is, this, this is about the best team I've seen by a mile. Of, uh, of this. Uh, this looks good. I'm going to watch this with these actual colours on. There you go. This is pretty good. I mean, I, I'm, I, I think a draw is probably the most likely result. You know, three guard for Andy, three guard for Artie. Um... They've both got a missing tackle that does nothing, right? So they, they, they vote. But Art has given up a skill to stack tackle on his mighty blow. So um, Andy is up a skill. And that skill is a block big un, And he's got another block big un, Whereas Art has gone a block trolls to be really safe versus the rats. And uh, woody, woodies. That we kind of expected to be some rats and woodies, right? But um, let you in, honk. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. Honk, honk. Honk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby. Hello, Elliot. Hello, Jimmy. How are you? I'm fantastic, thank you. How are you? Good, good, good. Oh, yeah, good, yeah, actually. Very good. The fox in the box? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Foxes seem really good, to be fair, from the gnome team. From reading Foxes them. are really good, yeah, really, really good. Mm. Two plus, two plus, and thing. Anyway, we should talk about the game rather than talk about just norms. Yeah, oh, yeah. let's not talk about norms for half an hour. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, interesting, interesting matchup, isn't it? I, I think I prefer the the mm, troll yes. for the for the mirror. Um, but only eleven players. Hard for to our... say, isn't it? Like, it's it's so hard to say with the troll, isn't it? Like, he's big and strong, and that's great, and he's also like. Dumb as fox, <laughs> which, which is not. <laughs> so yeah, but prob, 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 probably you like the strength that balance, right? Yeah, probably. Like, like, if the troll isn't good here, you know, where is it good? You exactly. Know, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You really shouldn't have taken him if you don't think it's giving you yes. an advantage in this yes. game because it sure isn't giving you an advantage in the elf games. Yeah. I like even like um, underworld to an extent, right? Because they can just foul it out just as easily as anything else. So like, it's a lot of TV. Against them, yeah, kind of yeah, things, and if they're dackering, it just like stands around, not being able to go very far. Yeah, yeah. So I, I'm honestly, I'm, I like instantly regretted taking my troll. The reason that I took the troll yeah. was for lizards mainly. You know, I just thought, oh god, lizards are just awful, aren't they? <laughs> so, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so it was primarily for lizards, but um, in retrospect, now that nobody's taken lizards, I was like, damn, I should <laughs> not have taken yeah. it. Like, J5 trying to get it back. Yeah, the guard biggins. Uh, honestly, I wish I'd gone for guard biggins like uh, like Diamond. It's, it's funny that we just randomly, <laughs> you know, we randomly did the whole guard biggins thing. Because it actually was brilliant. So Andy, oh no, no. Uh, Artemis has only two skilled biggins. And Andy has all four skilled biggins. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, because Art has put one of the, he's taken a block from a biggin and put it on the thrower. Stack. And the other one has gone to the stack, yep. So he's losing two skills for this game, right? Like, that's the problem, isn't it, by that stack? It's mm -hmm. uh, not some, not not what I would have done, the stack, I'll be honest. Um, I, I made, like, 16 teams, you know, for this. Like, I made one team of every race. And I actually only stacked a uh, sneaky, <laughs> sneaky get dirty player on uh, uh, over uh, the lines. I, I mean, think. That, that's the stack. <laughs> if, you, if you were ever going to stack anything, <laughs> uh, yeah, that was the only oh. thing I stacked. And the only thing I gave up money for was actually uh, Black Orcs, because even though they had like more money to spend, uh, it was like the it was they were just going to get like you know four assistant coaches or whatever. So I thought it was actually worth giving up a skill to get an extra goblin. Um, oh, so you you had one less skill. Like, yeah, you could you can give up a skill for like thirty more you could gold. Have done. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you, okay. you can give up a, a thirty yeah. gold. Yeah, but but wow, but orcs, but it couldn't take you to over twelve hundred gold, and black orcs are already at eleven ninety. Oh. So I was literally just giving it for ten gold, but I still thought it was oh. kind of worth it. But I mean, skills only twenty, isn't it? So do you know what I mean? Like in pure TV, 
um, you're only losing yeah. 10, but in effective TV, yeah. you, you, like, you weren't getting anything for the spare 40, basically. Like, I mean, assistant coaches could be critical, couldn't they, to be fair? But Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think I got a view all because I'm an assistant coach once. Yeah. yeah, I mean, honestly, I like I, I would I would dread just like losing to all the assists. You know, like somebody who's taken three assists and coaches, and you've got none, and then they get a real. It's a massive swing. Yeah, isn't it? yeah, so. yeah. No, I do. If I coach, is a bit good. Yeah. 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 Thank you, Morid. In between all that, sorry. Thank you very much, Morid. I'm for hundred bits, and uh, there is yeah, not goblins. I might have also taken a goblin for orcs as well. That was a that was a possibility because uh, you can see Andy's got two assistant coaches here, and ah, oh, doesn't because he's got the troll. Oh, it's got one. I think there was a possibility. Oh, yeah, so what you could have done is, rather than having the two assistant coaches, he could have uh, dropped a orc lineman down to two goblins, right? I'm pretty sure. I think this is... I think he's got, like... He, oh, Dave also oh, okay. got two coaches and a dedicated fans. So he, rather than having the lineman, he could have had two goblins. And I thought that was worth thinking about, right? 13 players, uh, get more fouls in. Chop an orc in half, and it's approximately two goblins. Yeah. Yeah, like it's because that thirty TV from the assistant coaches isn't very good, is it? So I mean, the only thing is then. Oh no, no, you, you don't have to play. You still have eleven plus two goblins, is yeah. that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Interesting. Yeah. So both sides pretty much just maxing blocks here, aren't they? St standing in front, don't want to, don't want to get beaten up. One D, Juan D. Oh, outrageous. Art about to go absolutely ballistic. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> the, the, the coach levels from one to five, that was hilarious. But I probably shouldn't uh, I probably shouldn't be the kind of person who laughs at that. But uh it was what, pretty what, funny. What Oh, I see. You, you, you mean like a bad person would, would laugh at that? Or... So, I'll, I'll explain for everybody watching. Um, Bonehead Podcast, I'm not having a go at them, okay? Did a video on uh, like coach skills levels and they went one through five on like the five wait, wait. different levels so, of coach skills. Coaching they, skill. Of co coach, like, were, they, ah, fucking hell, wow. were they actually <laughs> rating other Coaches? Not other people, no. They're just telling you what the levels are. So, like, level one is somebody who's read the rules. Uh, oh. A.K.A. not try. <laughs> yes, no, I, I also have not read the rules. Yet. <laughs> there you go. Level zero, Elliot. <laughs> level, level two, right? Level two was makes good, makes good mechanical choices in that they know when to dodge and they know when to GFI and stuff. And it's like, wait a minute. That's like I mean, nobody... That, that well, yeah, I, I, that, that's like the thing is it's extremely granular as well, right? Like, yeah, you, you know, what 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 does good mean? You know, like, you know, like see, if you take it to mean perfect, then you know nobody's a level two coach. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. and uh... everybody's either level zero or level two coach. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty much, that was pretty funny. And then level three was, uh, I think, just played. They played a bit. Um, and then oh, what? They, they played a bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they played a bit more. They've got level but, two, but they played a bit. Comes after making good decisions. Yeah. Who's going to touch a block? Yeah. <laughs> Man, I mean, I know some people are like, you know, they read the rule book and then they can play the game perfectly, not naming any names. But holy shit, being able to make good decisions whether to block or dodge without having to, uh, without having played a bit, it's pretty incredible. <laughs> Most people will get to level two in like one or two games, is what he said. Yeah, yeah, yeah it was incredible. And then like, and then level four is like you know top quality. You uh, you like you do you know good things. And then level five. <laughs> wait, wait. I, I don't know what it was. It was something. It's and then, fake. but yeah, no, I, I I'm, I'm trying to condense it because you know I, I, okay, it's not okay, just you know okay. like I'm not just want to I don't want to just make it all about this. But then but then level five was just a pro, right? And, and the definition was just a pro, <laughs> just just someone who's really really good at blood bowl, just a pro. <laughs> <laughs> and there was really no attempt to, to you know, to, to explain any of what would make a level five. It was brilliant. Anyway, right, let's try and get back to talk about anything about the game for the first three turns. That was way more interesting than Ortmo, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. 
<laughs> so yeah, they're, they're just milling around, aren't they? Trying to punch people and not yes. get punched as much as possible. Like that. That's <laughs> yeah, literally that was, it. Yeah, you, okay. you want to not yeah. get punched. They might well, try and surf, I guess, right? Is, is it? Mm. Okay, so let, you know, let's let's deep dive. Like, is is it like, are, 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 especially as orcs on offense, aren't we in danger of like milling about too much? You know, like yes. we so we saw turn one, we saw Artemis head right up that sideline, didn't he? You know, and he's mm. obviously he's not committed to that, but he's he, he headed up there. There's there's like a big one on the floor, five tiles into the half right, mm. and he and he's still kind of like over in this corner a bit. Like, yeah, you know, what what really should he be doing? Should should he be trying to press this sideline? Should we go back to the middle? So I'm guessing you just want to go back to the middle here and just hang around a bit longer. Do you think or or are you trying to gain space? Well, I think he, what, he needs the turn where he doesn't have stuns, right? He, he needs a turn where, like, he had that Black Oak stun. Not, not, not Black Oak, nor is it. I'm not, I'm not racist at all. <laughs> they used to be called Black Oak, okay? I was on here. Gnomes are the best in the world. Gnomes are the best in the world. Jim, what are you laughing for? There I'm being go. serious. Yeah, nah, you exactly. Yeah, I'm outside. Here. Here. I don't do this, long. but some maybes. I do absolutely. Yeah, it it's finished. There you go. Thank you very much, Steve. Staying fantastic for 38 glorious months. And yeah, norms are the best in the world. That's true. Yeah, so I think. I always <laughs> said Steve White knows what he's talking about. Yeah. So Art pushed up, right? Then he got the big and stun. Now he's got another big and stun. Mm. So I think, I think the stun is what's, you know, making him hold off on the full contact. I think once he gets not stunned. Right, <laughs> or if so, he so makes, that's the other thing. Makes a stun himself. How do you? Yeah. Okay. So right. Yeah. Okay. So sorry, sir. That was good. About my question is, is how do you push up? Like you, you have to make contact. So you say you, you, yeah. you wait. You're waiting for that, for the for having a bit of a man's advantage with the player stunned or something. Yeah. Exactly. You, you you need to be like the fight is the most important thing. Pretty much always, right? In Blood Bowl, I, 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 let's say ninety percent of the time. I made that up. Obviously, if you, if you say that like most of the time, you know, if if it's just all about making two dice blocks and everything, and then you'll get to a point where you know you've got. Your standing players, not necessarily you know removals, but your standing players advantage, you will get one of those, and then from then you can leverage that into a good position, can't you? And yes, it will necessitate giving up hits and stuff, right, to push forward. Like in this case, he's, he's moved the troll in, hasn't he? So as, as the defence, Andy but, though didn't leverage his Sandy players advantage after he stunned the biggins, as you noticed, mm. uh, by, by basing. Sorry, he didn't leverage by basing. He, he still carried on standing off. Do you yeah. like that as well, or, or do, do you? So you be, you like the standing off on defense then? Yeah, I think the standing off on defense is okay because because that forces Art now to go for a more desperate later push, right? Like you, 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 if he if he if if Andy pushes in, then maybe that you know leaves a gap for Art to like swing around, make some dodges, push through, gives up the hit, gets a guy removed, stuff like this, right? But but if if the fight is the most important thing ninety percent of the time, don't you want to try and take that advantage even on defense and try and win that fight? If and you if, can, and if Artemis yeah. does push up early, isn't that maybe bad for him? If you can, yeah. If you can, like this is a, yeah. I didn't I didn't really like the early push to be honest. If you can, because now now like he's got he's got two guards isolated over here, hasn't he? Compared to the rest of the well, team. yeah so yeah, it's interesting, right? Because he's tried to like develop a local man's advantage, right, with the, the troll and the you know the other orc in, where you're trying to like not get hit, right, as he's, he's sort of switching. But yeah, he has left behind those two uh, piggins, hasn't he? Mm. The good thing for him is, I guess, all the guards are over here for for Andy. Yes, so yes. It's yeah, hard for him to get guard round up to here to help. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, it's interesting. I find this interesting because it's so. I like on like on a basic surface level it's a dumb old game and and probably that's all or and probably that's really all of this to it and if you get lucky by you know killing more orcs than your opponent then you'll win and if you if you get unlucky then you lose and probably that's about all this blood bowl but it, it's kind of interesting it threatens to be a bit more involved than that right and it's cool to try and think about that and I, yeah. it seems very like Un unsolved right you know it's it, you know the, the you know these questions that i'm asking they're obviously like like kind of semi-hypothetical and stuff like it's still interesting like you know it's it's hard to say exactly what is going on there a lot of the time yeah. i feel like and, and honestly like guys uh, so he's had to do the gear fight to get in yeah it's one of those things where like i mean i don't know about you but i don't really think about things like that but they no, kind of yeah, happen. No. Do you know what I mean? Like I feel like I should, of... right? Yeah. I, feel, I feel like you know, to to be to be a pro, then you've got to think about <laughs> you know that kind of stuff, right? Yeah. Like to a real pro, like a uh, Magnus Carlson, not even like a Kful, right? Like yeah. Kful just probably doesn't think about that, right? You know, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he's probably like I know, 
daydreaming or something like as he smashes his <laughs> as he smashes his opponents to pieces. He's just you know wandering through a field of flowers or something while he you know stomps all over his opponent's team. You know. Uh, yeah, it's but, true. Like uh, on the, yeah, honestly, like Dio is the only. Uh, funnily enough, right? Dio and Adam Savage are the only people that I've uh, <laughs> that I've known to like kind of actively approach yeah. it from that kind yes, of point of view. Yeah. yeah. And yeah, and, and as much as we love so so incredibly much to take the piss out of Dio, absolutely, <laughs> you know it is cool that you know he, he does kind of do that. You know, as, as, as much as we absolutely love the bullshit, it's it's kind of cool that he you know he's, he 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 kind of like, has that angle. Yeah, and and it would be cool to see like like taken further. You know, like I don't know if it was possible. Probably yeah, for us to do. Yeah, I mean, and also yeah, yeah. If it's possible, if it's meaningful, because yeah, yeah you, you might you know you might make like. Yo, know, you heard of these uh, uh the special names that I can't remember. Like uh, the the idea that there's like an equation for the universe, right? The idea that the entire universe can be cap- encapsulated in some kind of like you know massive, massive, massive you know mathematical system. Mm. Well, yeah, you know, if you imagine that for Blood Bowl, right? You know, just for Blood Bowl, you know, much a much easier proposition for sure. <laughs> yeah, you know, if you imagine if you managed to capture the entirety of Blood Bowl in a in a mathematical equation, you've got your your supercomputer, yeah. You know, but it's not even trained on AI. This is actually uh, <laughs> analytical. It's actually you know the pro- the entire massive equation it takes like 50 tail flops or whatever but uh, you've got your equation and the equation says you know bang on men you know the equation says if you if you get more on pace than your opponent you win <laughs> and you're like wow fuck <laughs> football is you know just a double game after all <laughs> yeah it's interesting isn't it because like he looks like he's swinging back because like you know you ask those questions there and i was able to kind of answer them uh, you know, like kind of how I thought, but I never really thought about it. But I kind of had thought about it, if you know what I mean. Like I had the answer yeah, already, yeah, even though yeah. I had never asked the question myself. It's a funny, it's just a funny old game, isn't it? It, was, it, it, it really is, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, I think it's <laughs> the theory of everything was also bang on. I mean, to be honest, <laughs> <laughs> it pretty much is. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa! He's rolled a two plus. He's rolled a one. He has to reroll it because he wants to block this ooh. card guy. Yeah. So the reason he didn't was because if he powered him, he would have freed him, right? So he was being he was being a little bit greedy there, hoping for the pow and free this guy. Yeah. And like maybe he was going to move him back one or something. But him standing it's, it's was fair kind of okay, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's 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 interesting with the GFI coming, right? Like obviously, if you're not GFIing, then you're you're all you're leaving him down all day long to move mm. him a square or whatever. But with the GFI, you know, you're like, oh, I don't know. It was t- double so, GFI yeah. as well. It was double GFI. Oh, was so. it double? Ooh, yeah. Wow, okay, spicy. Hacking, yeah. hacking, spicy. Yeah, so I don't know how much better the square that he could move to if he was able to move yes, was exactly, than that yeah. to make it worth the, you so, know, so yeah, where, all that where, and stuff. Where, where is he moving? Is he going two squares, like uh, one square to the right and two squares up? Like really far forward, but then the ball's a bit exposed, right? Yeah, like, where I is he like, going? That was I quite better. liked him where he was. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly, yeah. That, that square looks pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, is he like tagging the mighty blow blitzer to but that doesn't seem as bad like you're just giving a free block really like and he's probably happy to put in two orcs to take that block yeah. are we going to see this this drive calling it now is going to be a mr throw pass to a blitzer this i is, think it is yeah this, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we've got to the point now there's three turns left for art you know he'll be happy to score any turn so i think the blitzer's on this on this uh blitzer here because without bits in this blitzer, I think you know, like he's already okay. He's at least mark him, yeah, with a with a big him, yeah, okay. And so, and so, uh, uh, is this like how how happy are with this? Are we with this position as Artemis with having like probably looking at the blitzer scoring, at least that being a big part of our game plan? And the corollary is, what should we have done to avoid this sort of? To, to, to avoid our sort of realistic scoring thread at, at the moment, at least being being this blitzer pass, you know, sh- sh- what, how, how should we have sort of played this half up until now, or, or should we have played it like he has done? Well, I can answer for Artemis perfectly here. He should just roll better. That's the answer to all the problems. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Another of pointless course. dicing. <laughs> men says the algorithm. Not men. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's interesting, isn't it? Yeah, like maybe that push was too 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 hard and fast at the start. You know, maybe he could have been more patient. And, and but then, you know, if he didn't take, those, he has taken the two stuns. You know, like if he had if he had caused those two stuns, maybe he's barreled down this side, and and you know everything's looking fantastic. So it could just be the dice, like you know, Art could be right, and it could just be the dice. 
it, it it's interesting because I, I I'm sure I've talked about this before on the stream before, but you know in the final we saw Diomed and Strider of the the first World Cup right, the first World Three World Cup, and uh, yeah. and defenders were really on top in that game right. Like obviously yeah. Lizards kind of you know typically a good a good defensive team, but always well to some extent. And it makes me think in this kind of situation, like between two you know very high level coaches with you know similar similar sort of. Uh, similar, you know, coaching grades, both both fives, I'd say. Then probably you're like, I, I mean, I mean not, maybe not probably, but to to me it seems like um, that you know m m maybe the defense is on top, right? You know, maybe you don't score uh, more often than you do score, right? You know, uh, mm -hmm. certainly if there's not some kind of like comedy mega, you know, oh dear, five orcs died on the LS <laughs> or something, you know, which obviously happens a lot, but yeah. uh, but uh, but yeah, I don't know. I, 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 I'm coming from the perspective of, well, when I play these shit teams like Orcs, I, I don't <laughs> score many touchdowns. I'm standing there, turn eight, being like, hmm, what went wrong here? You know, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> how could I have made it not go wrong? I don't know. And this is fucked, isn't it, by the way? <laughs> it's, it's not that bad, actually. It's, it's not that bad when you think about it, right? Because it's there's four players to two over here, isn't there? These are tagged off, so a big swing to the other side, and, and you know, maybe he gets lucky, but yeah, it's pretty fucked. I mean, he's taken. This big one's been stunned yeah. twice. He's taken four stuns to nothing. Yeah. He's Have we had any stuns on Andy's team yet? I don't no, think so, right? No, no. Art's done nothing. <laughs> yeah. Zero damage from Art, and he's taken four stuns, and you know, those margins get bigger, don't they, with like lower TV and less skills, you know, like. Four yeah. stuns. If if both teams were leading with mighty blow and guard, the four stuns maybe aren't so, aren't so bad because you might have got a removal of your own and stuff and some KOs or whatever. But but as it is, he's done nothing to him. And those four skill, those four stuns, he hasn't got the the skills, the guard, the strength, the mighty blows to break through reliably anyway, has he? It's it's tough. I think he's got to do the what he's going to do the troll block into blitz a blitz, right? Which, if he goes stupid, this is pretty horrible. Oh, yes. And he yes. does. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, no, it was I a mean... GFI. It was a GFI. Okay. Oh, oh whoa. Now he that? really has to get the troll Ooh, moving. Holy yeah. shit. That's uh... <laughs> do, do, do we Do we like that GFI even? What, what? So, okay, so why have we done that GFI? Why have we done the GFI? Can we think? To, so that Mr. Throw can score because he's moving. Yeah, fine. but he, 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 can, he can score anyway, right? He can just do the GFIs in a later turn, yeah. which is surely better than doing them like in front of that blitzer. <laughs> I think, yeah... I mean, I well, I think the the rationale was if I fail this, I lose anyway. But um, yeah, even now it, he it, could just be mm. like, even now he can get hit, can't he, by a big one? Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, like that. I don't know that seemed like a really, but but there must be no reason why. Right? But maybe, maybe that was just a maybe it's just a bit of a. I, I think a bit of a mistake probably if yeah. that was the reason. If we're not missing something, like, but is he like? I'm thinking like. Uh, does being in that square give him an easier pass somewhere might, next turn? Maybe you know. This guy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No. Ah. Uh, one, two, three, mm. four, five, six. Not really, right? It could have been mm. something like that, right? If he gets uphill and he gets powered, it could be something. Yeah. I'm not seeing. Okay. It. it could have just been a mistake. Yeah. 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 Yeah, level five coach, he knew one was coming, so he avoided it on the really stupid by doing the GFI first. Yeah. <laughs> what that a pro. Could be it. <laughs> Wow, it's been a bit oh, rough. Ah, we we just we just pushed the scoring threat blitz, so that's kind of interesting. Kind kind of mm. interesting in that we might open up some options next turn. Mm. Yeah, you'd imagine that. Like, it's it's a bit tough because my my temptation is like I know blitz the tackle mighty blow or something, smashing in the front of Mister Throw, but. But yeah, it's, it, the more you smash in, the more you kind of risk something in behind, right? Especially with that blitzer exactly, there. Like, yeah. are, are we even blitzing that blitzer? Oh, I don't know. I think we're blitzing the ball, honestly. Guard the, does oh, you GFI. Think so? Guard GFI, 1D yeah. the troll, follow, and then you hit with this big one. I think that's what he's doing as well. Yeah, he's done the GFI. Okay, fair. That's step A. He's, he's done the 1D. Fair. He's rolled a skull. He gets the push. So yep, two D on the ball. Oh yeah, I was I was thinking about blocking away like the troll and the blitz. If we don't even need to block the blitz, do you? Yeah, that's no, pretty. Exactly, yeah. That's pretty good. Because he made that GFI. Because he spent yeah. the reroll getting it, making his yeah. guy blitzable. <laughs> oh, yeah. and he's got powered. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> but sucked off a reroll first. Yeah, <laughs> Mister So picks up the ball, throws it to the blitzer. Off we go. Yep. 
I'll, I'll go live in the Discord, actually, if you want to see it live. I'll okay, cool. yeah, yeah, normally. Cool. I'll leave it off normally because Dimmy doesn't mind being a bit slow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is looking really bad for right now. It might even a possible counter score, right? It's a yeah, possible. Yeah, yeah. Because this is now... Position is completely disintegrated. Oh, we've even managed to block the bigger than not the blitzer. Yeah. It's quite good. <sighs> yeah, this is real good. Um, I don't know. Honestly... So we can we can blitz the Lino, we can uphill the big one. 4 plus pick up with Mr. Throw, 5 plus pass, maybe? Or, or dodge 4 plus pass, the blitzer, off we go. <laughs> I think we just gotta go for it, right? Let's go. <laughs> You could try and Dodge free somebody GFIs. up to block this guy down, because Andy's only got two turns, so getting this guy knocked down would be really nice yeah. for safety. You don't really want to lose. Yeah, I guess, yeah. And if, and, behind. and if we are thinking, you know, you know, defences are up here, then maybe we are pretty happy to try and take the take the nil nil. Yeah. Like, I mean, try 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 and play for the nil nil in the game. You know, try and defend that next half. Yeah. An armor break. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, it's not like it's not like NAF style where you have to win every game in the tournament, um, or you can't win the tournament. You know, so like, so yeah. a, a draw here is a totally reasonable, a totally fine. Oh, he's going for Ooh. the chain. Yeah. Oh, oh. oh, that's quite cool. Yeah. Mm. Re rolls it. Oh, fails. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, yeah. Now we're out. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> we, we don't have a Mister. I was thinking Andy's Mister Throw is near the ball, but it's not. No. Um, so yeah, it's. Uh, but now, Andy does get to blitz, blitz this guy, off, and then he's yeah. got a very valid scoring threat. I mean, could even... I, it, um, could, could go through it all this turn, is what I'm thinking, right? Um, yeah, it depends how the dice roll. He's only got one dice, one reroll left. Yeah. If you try everything first, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> then uh, see what happens. I think I'd go for this blockless block, and then scatter the Yeah, ball. insane, yeah. Gives you free Scatter it, you think? To, yeah, then it gives you free chances to uh, free chances to catch it, right? The thing is, I quite like blitzing the blitzer free and then hand it, trying the handoff to him this turn. Maybe yeah, I would as well. But I'd just go, I'd go yeah. for this block first, and then uh, the I'm just thinking if it scatters to the left or like mm. backwards, you can't really hand off. But yeah, but then you then you uh, can I guess then I'd hand off next turn, right? So I'd, yeah, fair, fair enough, fair enough. Yeah, that's what I'd be trying to do. I'd be trying to get. The, I think I'd go for the scatter here. Also, it like puts you know the big one in there and everything, doesn't it? Also, he's not blitzing him with the line. Oh, he's like blitzing himself off. Yeah, probably. so he's not going for it. This so time. he's just definitely yeah, yeah. It's, it's but yeah, it may may well be the right play to go. Yeah. It's not like the or the or the, or the or Artemis or orcs are cashing him anyway. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. He's totally. He's going to be totally unmolested. It's just they, they could they could catch the lino, but like they'll probably be screened off and stuff, right? Yeah. I don't have any rerolls either. Oh. Ooh. Interesting. Oh, you would have left him and moved him? I think so, yeah. That was my instinct. Also, this way he can catch the ball, whereas if you left him down, he couldn't catch the oh, ball. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, he's pushing the other way. Okay, yeah, fair enough. The problem now is that this guy's free, but then he's just a big one, isn't it? So if you, but you've got to you can't you can't make the pass. The kind of like you could try and make a pass, but yeah, I would have yeah, gone. Yeah, pass it four plus, but yeah, I'd done that hit first, and then if I power him, then I move him back like one, and then move this guy around so you've got the full screen, right? Mm. But I yeah, guess you don't I was have thinking we would one on a power anyway. So actually, yeah, probably sending him first is better, right? You're not getting that much more by moving him one square. Yeah, is he passing? Uh, he's passing. No, he's double, double GFI. Oh man! Double GFI. Oh, to get away from the big one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I missed a throw. <laughs> <laughs> this blitzer is the only one left. Do you dodge? Um. Or do you one D, one D here? No, wrong one. Ah, yeah, one D the big one. Yeah. One D the big one, and that gives you this guy to come around. And shut down that guy. He's just gonna oh. dodge. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Okay. You, no, you can take that block now. You've put the yeah. In, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, this guy can't well, reach. Well, I, I say that. It's 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 three plus three plus now. It's easier now than it was before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He should have been one up, shouldn't he? Yeah, yeah. Would have done it. Or at least one up, like he could have been two up, probably, because he went up around yeah. and he could have probably been. Oh, because he stood up north, so he could have been yeah one up. <laughs> one up's probably the best, isn't it? Yeah. Well, he hasn't gone for it. Oh wait, he, he had to stand up. Wait, no, that's no, the right. other guy, the, 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 the tackle man, the tackle man, the tackle mighty. The tackle mighty. Oh yeah, 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 yeah the guy he oh, pushed. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's a double three. Yeah. Oh yeah, so that 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 makes him better as well, doesn't it? Yeah, he's doubly better one square up. I was only looking at this guy, but yeah, the tackle guy's still standing. Yep. So there we go. Ooh. That guy should have been one nil up, uh -oh. one further <laughs> up, but he rolled a two anyway. No. Oh. Yeah, he's so much better one one up, isn't he? Because that's like a four yeah. five three instead of a three three. Yeah, <laughs> way better one square up. Bit of a bit of an ever. Oh yeah, and the carrier could have just been further at the side as well. Yeah, there was no reason for the carrier to be there. The carrier could have been over here, couldn't he? Andy, yeah. not a level two coach. <laughs> <laughs> well. There you go. Devo gets the turnover and oh. score. And that really puts the it. pressure on Art, doesn't it? Because now Art has to counter score. Like, you know, if at least if he got out of it nil nil, he could just try and stop the score. But now he has he, to get the turnover. He he does, and that's kind of one of the nice things about being on, on defence, right, is that now the offence is like kind of very low pressure, right? You you don't mm. have to score, that's incredible. Yeah. G given you have the knowledge of, of getting the turnover. Yeah, yeah, I, I do. An like incredible game. I, 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 I don't know. It's, it's been, <laughs> it's been a game of blood bowl. It's been incredible yeah. having the professional norm in the in, in, in the booth. Some good insights and and you know intelligent questions and stuff. Very good. Very good. Very good. You know, theory theory bowl more than just. Well, um, I, I try. Like I, I like. I'd love to. You know, I, I'd love to like. Do theory bowl stuff, but I don't know. It's like, it's 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 weird, isn't it? Blood bowl. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It's really weird. Yeah. It's so weird. It's it's so weird. <laughs> There's no punchline or further thought to that. It's just really weird, isn't it? No. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> and and the more and more you think about it, as well, the the more and more you think, for oh, you know, let's let's do some deep dives. You think yourself. But what's the point? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah. It would be interesting if this was like an esports with millions of dollars prize money, right? Yeah. If, if this was an esports with millions of dollars prize money, then you would get all the Magnus Carlsen like people and yes. that with that level of dedication as well. Because cause even if Kfog, you know, could be Magnus Carlsen, right? Let's say he could be for argument's sake. He's uh -huh. he's not gonna put that dedication in the boot bowl, is he? No. Right? Yeah, not, no yeah. one's gonna so so Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah, it would be it would be cool. There's there's probably a bunch of things like that in life where like uh in in the world where like, you know, <laughs> imagine if you pumped, you know, fifty million pounds into it and see what happens. Yeah, you know, it would be quite <laughs> yeah. interesting. Yeah. It would certainly be interesting to have with Blood Bowl. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And the funny thing is it would be it would be it would be across things where the motivation for with for no money is is still greater anyway, but because there was money involved, you would do it. Do you know what I mean? Like, for example, oh yeah, like yeah. having you know, say a half an hour walk every day, right? Amazing uh -huh, health uh -huh. benefits, right? For uh, uh -huh. the hour of exercise is the thing, but it's probably something like ten minutes walking or something, something as stupid as that. Yeah, oh yeah, it's like yeah, going to yeah, yeah. massively increase yeah, loads yeah. of well-being, and people just aren't going to fucking do it. But if you are like, yeah. well, you get a million pounds for doing it, then they're like, right, I'm never going to fail ever. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, that million pound uh, over your life is nowhere near as good as the health benefits that you would get. Funny, isn't it? Well, <laughs> I'm not even over, your life, <laughs> over your life, over your life, Elliot. Over your life. I mean, I, I, I'd do it for a five or two dollars. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, pound, so yeah maybe really. a million was a bit strong. <laughs> maybe a million was a bit strong. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a lot of money, you know. Would I rather live ten years less and have a million pounds more? Well, hey, that's, yeah, that's a tough one. <laughs> 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 yeah, but you know what I mean, though. You know what I mean. Like, quality of life might make a big di make might make a yeah, big difference. Yeah, for sure. Over for sure, time. For sure. It depends, obviously, how well off the people are without it. But you know, you know what I mean. Yeah, that sort of thing. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. That yeah. sort of thing. 
if you made it. And even if you, even if people got nothing, right? Even if it was just a chance, right? You know, like your town of a hundred thousand people, one person oh, would get yeah. a million pound. There's like a draw. There's a there's a walking oh, lottery. Oh, they would they would love that. <laughs> Holy shit! They would be people walking around all over all day long. Yeah. Holy shit! Yeah, there you go. And their EV is 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 just not is it's totally outscaled by the health benefits. But that little bit yeah. of motivation would get them to do things that were good anyway. So yeah, that's interesting. Yeah. <laughs> money isn't the only motivation, I, I, of course not J five, but it's it's funny how the, the the concept of it and the the idea of like the chance of it would would really motivate people beyond. And sometimes it wouldn't as well, right? Like it's funny. It's funny. Uh, this is uh, I don't know. Should I say this? I might. I might as well say it. I might as well. Say it. It's, it's not too bad. It's not. It's just. It's just maybe it's a bit weird and too personal for some people. Ooh, I Ooh. But my mum, uh, you know, had a has had both her hips replaced. Actually, both of her hips replaced because she's old, right? She's eighty four, and uh, there was a time when her hip was really bad, and she would walk to the shops, and then she would cross the road to save a penny. <laughs> <laughs> because because something was like you know seventy p on one side of the road and sixty nine oh, on the oh, other. Cross to, to to a different shop, you mean? Yeah, yeah, different shop because, okay, see, see, because okay, okay. one of the <laughs> items was cheaper. And it's like if somebody like you know if it was if somebody <laughs> gave her a pound and said walk over there, she'd be like fuck <laughs> you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll give you a pound if you cross the road. You'd be like, "Who the fuck are you talking to?" But if it's like you, cro- if it's you could save a pound on your shopping, like most people would be like, "Yeah, I'm crossing the road." <laughs> like like classic weird, mum behaviour. To be like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, fair enough, J5, fair enough. There's another removal, so Art continues to have all of the bad luck, but he did he did Apple it. He did Apple that, obviously. I don't know why I started looking at the side, because obviously he appled that KO, but yeah. Art continues to have zero of the luck, four stuns and a KO, and he's he's done nothing, right? He hasn't even stunned on, uh, Dave O'Walk, I don't believe. I don't believe he's even made a stun. I don't know if he's been outbashed, May, maybe marginally, but, but of course, having your guy stunned doesn't help. Oh, there we go, there's a stun. <laughs> Some kind of parody. Wow, those orcs have got uh, flaming heads. <laughs> mm, mine have got flaming heads too. Yeah, good isn't it. That's pretty actually good. pretty good. Yeah, that's yeah. pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's he's going full eyes, uh, going full Malmir and trying the big and dodges. Yeah. Fair enough. Don't remember I played Malmir and he made seven of eight. Yeah, no, <laughs> oh, I don't remember that actually, Jimmy. Tell me more. <laughs> Played he played some orc had... dodgers, did he? So yeah. some big dodgers. Uh, Honestly, he had a much better team than me. And in addition to that, <laughs> he like made six that, out of that, seven big that's, dodgers. That's always the kicker, isn't it? It's like, okay, okay, I'm fucking outmatched here. You don't have to be a lucky bastard as well, please. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's Malmir with a bigger orc team and I'm Dwarf. It's like, you know, <laughs> the least game where he needs to roll well to win. And uh, and then oh, I, I GFI, didn't I? Double one, I snaked a GFI with my uh, yeah, ball Yeah, the ball and chain, yeah. Hey. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure I got lucky to get him to the spot where he needed the GFI, so it's, it's okay, isn't it? I'm not, I'm not really bitter about it, but uh, it was just no, 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 I can tell. <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> oh <my> God. <laughs> yeah. So, okay. So this drive, we have to do something as armors. Yes. What, what is it, and when do we do it? That's a good question. So I was faced with a similar kind of situation in the play-ins, you know, the the play-ins, and I was I was uh, losing to mm, the NAF thing. Yeah, the NAF thing. I was losing. No, it was one one. It was one one, and I had I just had to stop him. So actually, I misplayed. I guess <laughs> <laughs> terrible example. Um, but I felt like I was losing, and I felt like it, well, because I was dwarves, I felt like I was horribly outmatched on defense, and there was no way I could stop him. Right. So I thought to try and stop him, I've got to get ridiculously lucky. So I just played like a madman and like based you know, like lunatic basing and stuff, and just hoping that I'd get some kind of luck going. Oh. Away. Oh, th- t- so this was in the, the, the not not the NAF thing, the, after the NAF thing, you mean? Yeah, the, after the NAF, the play-ins, yeah, oh, the season yeah, two play-ins. Played in, yeah, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. okay, yes, yeah, so this was the Dwarf, was it Dwarf Dwarf or Dwarf Orc? Dwarf, dwarf Orc, yeah, Dwarf Orc, dwarf orc. yeah, 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 oh, yeah, I remember this one, yeah. Yeah, he got the riot and scored. <laughs> uh, oh, yes, hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so without, yeah, that, yeah. without that riot, so, yeah, so I would have played You started wrong, going pretty early, but you also yeah. probably, you know, slightly tilting maybe. Do you think, you, like, was that right for you to do, do you think? Or? So, I mean, honestly, for me, in this position, as the defending orcs here, like, I kind of feel like 
why not start now you know like yeah. whatever we're doing like what's the point in waiting in, in a sense right you know we, yeah. we gotta just get manting up and hope we get lucky or, or whatever it is that the plan is you know well last turn he had the stun didn't he yeah last turn true, one of ours was stunned oh, this yes. turn one of okay. andy's is stunned no, so this is the turn. so this is this the go is this like the trigger yeah. Yeah. again like looking and for those I sort of micro man advantages that you were talking about in the mm. first half yeah yeah dream exactly. team come Hard and so as, as Andy on defence in the first half, um, is okay after obviously all. not that you know down one nil. Uh, we're uh, we're standing off even when we have those advantages, right? Yeah, yeah, a few times we we had a few art and Zorks done, but we still we still pretty much stood off, right? Unless we uh, uh, except when we were like forced in by the basing. Yeah. So, but but obviously here we we have to take a different approach and just yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, I think the choice is, to go yeah. to go mad. Yeah, I think the choice is taken from Art, and yeah, and I played yeah. like I thought that choice had been choice had been made for me in the play. But yeah. it was it was one one. It was just the same if it's been nil nil. So i you know maybe I did misplay, but I don't know. There was an element of desperation because I felt my team was outmatched as well. And uh, yeah. Laura Dan, thank you very much for the bits. Ooh, and oh, oh wow. my god, early oh. GG would have been a good one. And that is a that is a huge Kaz, a absolutely huge Kaz, right? A guard big one. Yeah. Apple doesn't matter because there's no overtime or anything. So. Yeah. Well, unless we steal the ball in like the next three turns and uh, <laughs> we're trying for the two one, but uh, yeah, that ain't yeah, happening. Surely, surely we don't have it. Yeah. Yep. And Umbalum, thank you very much. Staying fantastic for fourteen glorious months. Dream team come. Hard pill to swallow, but maybe maybe Blood Bowl three is okay after all. It's it's gotten a lot better at it's looking at garbage. It's gotten a lot better at looking at, but the playability is there only with a auto clicker for me. Like I cannot, I still cannot play it with without an auto clicker to like you know smooth the standing players up and stuff. I, I just, I just literally can't. <laughs> it, it would, I would still be clicking you know for thirty seconds to stand players up without that. So, yeah, this seems a bit half man's to me. Honestly, like it's a little we're getting bit a like lot that. of blocks here really easily. There's my mm. problem with this. I guess the thing is, if he does make those blocks, you know, he's armor nine. It's not, it's not that easy. And maybe something will happen. Like, I mean, there's kind of a big commitment to make all the blocks. And maybe is what he's thinking. But yeah, uh, yeah, it is a bit half manzy. But then this guy's a floating assist, isn't he? This guy's stopping him yeah. getting assisted. Uh, he obviously, if he exposed him, we didn't want him taken out. So. It, yeah, it, it does look a bit half manzy, but, uh, but the removal helps make it less half manzy, right? Because now he's got now it he's does, remote. but that's kind of why I'm surprised it looks half manzy because it's kind of sort of always going to look a bit shit if you're basing <laughs> up a full team with your full team. Right? It's like, yeah, no shit, I'm getting blocks back. But <laughs> yeah. with, with two orcs down this turn, you know, the the stunned one and the and the cast one, I thought we might, you know, look a bit mm. strong, but maybe not. Like it's it's hard, right? It's hard to be fair. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, this is still this is still a tough situation for uh, Andy, isn't it? Mm -hmm, mm. I think I like blocking the guard big and like right into the middle of those three orcs, right, and then we can yeah block something else. Ooh, looks the, is that the bl oh no, that, that was the oh my god, you rolled. Rolled? Oh, he rolled. He rolled. He needed that in the down, I guess. I guess that's what he needed. Oh, oh yeah, but for a reroll, oh. it's not what I would have done. But oh, it's because he's, he's going to surf. It's because he's going to surf the big one. Uh, it's Andy. No, it's he's not gonna. No. Okay. Well, I thought he was gonna surf the big one because he could have blocked this Is guy, he... couldn't he? He could he could have blocked here and then yeah, he could have blocked yeah, here, one that guy, and then he yeah. could have pushed him to there and then surfed. He could have blitzed him and then surfed him. And I thought I thought that was the play. <laughs> <laughs> But even Andy is is oh. <laughs> is sensible enough to not do that. So he he just thought he he needed him down to like not get um like block too much Go. next turn i guess and, and he's so he can blitz this big and right it's so he can oh, okay blitz this yeah big and then get him yeah. free whereas cool. if he wasn't down this would just be a 1d blitz and a dodge off so it's kind of freed two players and knocked over a player by getting the power well, it's not uh, two did players. he did he get a he got a free reroll as well i think he's on three rerolls oh, now yeah. so yeah so it made you a bit more tempted to put it i guess yeah for yeah. that four i mean it's high value knocking your guard big and down right and open up some more blocks and stuff but, yeah, yeah we rolls are worth a lot, yeah. yeah Ooh. It's spicy. Okay, Ooh. Oh, well, there's the man advantage gone. Can't get that out. Yeah. But it's just alignment, so quality is still. Yeah, it's still a, still a superior team, yeah. And this this troll can waddle with a, oh. with anything, oh, yeah, right. anything. The troll. <laughs> no, 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 no. The, the troll can waddle in the middle now, can't he? Which is a uh, amazing uh, yeah, square yeah, for yeah. the troll. So here, here comes the the, the troll like 
not not done much so far, <laughs> but uh, you know, this is exactly the kind of place where you, you want him, really, isn't it? You know, being yeah. able to just say, "Hey, let's smash in every turn, put a strength five guard guy in the middle of this team." Yeah, you know, try and make him deal with that. Yeah, really nice. I guess the troll is always going to be a little bit not always, but like it's it's probably probably strong on defense in a way, right? Where you can just kind of put it places and not really care. Whereas on offensive, it's you know. Um, Stupid thing and stuff, it really breaks your offense down. And yeah, the trolls better like exactly. posing questions than than trying yes, to yeah, solve exactly. answers, like trying to get yeah. answers. Yeah, yeah, this is uh, this is getting a bit dodgy, but he does have this like art's got to shore this up somehow, hasn't he? Hmm, like, yeah, maybe because he's got the um, center, he's got the center locked. He has. I'm just thinking, like, is there a world in which you want to, you know, entice him down that sideline a little mm, bit and then slam in? Maybe, but the fact that it's one, he's one nil down, it's less True. likely. True. Harder to make it so that he can't go forward or backwards. Yeah. If he goes down there, for sure. And he, he is locking it down. I mean, if Ooh, this yeah, was... the blitz around the back is pretty cool. That's yeah. Yeah. Needs like to make that. things happen. If this was nil nil, I'd be I'd be betting on you know uh, Art getting the stop for nil nil. But it's really yes, hard yeah, now, isn't sure. it? With it being having to get the turnover, it just yes. Yeah. Haven't blitzed yet, so I guess the might. I guess he's going to finally stand up this guard and then blitz this one. Well, it's only a one day though, isn't it? I was thinking he had an assist here for some reason. Blitzing the uh, centre when you're already massively player. ahead there doesn't seem so good, does it? Yeah. And it's like you you free them up, you free the players up as well if you put them right, like, yeah, un, unbase them. I guess you could stand here and then you could blockless blitz the blitzer. That's that's not bad at all, is it? But maybe he doesn't want to commit him, but then he has to commit him to get two dice. Yeah, maybe you commit him. Maybe you just put the blitzer there and then maybe maybe it. could have uh, moved the blitzer around the back next to the lino. And, yeah, he does blitz the guard, but this just oh, 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 scores. <laughs> kind of has also, to reroll like, now. The, gu the guard's like floating then, right? Like, I mean, if you just think arm broken anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I think Devo just not needs to not get sacked or take an easy score. Now, obviously, orcs are unlikely to just get an easy score. Like Skaven, Skaven in this situation, it's a nightmare to play against, isn't it? Because you know, a handoff and a dodge away, and you, you, you're cooked. So oh, what's the dodge? Ooh. Seems weird. Unlike on, on, on the basing turns, dodging away just seems weird. Like he's worried about getting surfed, but honestly, if he's playing for the surf there, it's like, you know, you're gonna have a chance on the ball probably, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think it, this I, seems I, like I, I much prefer the the blitzer coming in here and then the big and yeah, yeah, something but, like that. Because now the center's completely. I mean, it's still a very like. Imagine if he made the dodge as well. If he made the dodge, this is like ridiculously strong. For yeah, that. true, true, true. Like the, the center's yeah. completely collapsed. <laughs> I, well, it, is it though? Like he could stand up those guards. He can chain the troll off by blocking the tackle guy, mm. or he can chain his own uh, mighty blow backwards, hit the big one. Mm. Maybe he isn't completely lost. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> so maybe this was the right blitz then. <laughs> but I like I like that bit less though, right? Because that's kind of enabled it, right? Because the, the, those both of those guards are now like kind of like free if he clears that might if that yeah. blitz are right. Like at least the blitzer was the Andy's blitz was attached to the troll before. Yeah, interesting. Super interesting. <laughs> I mean, you know, you can tell from the amount of time that Andy's taken, he's not really happy about mm. the situation. Oh yeah, I know. Yeah, and you know, it's 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 you know, you're definitely saying, "Ooh, you know, this is spooky here, right?" For sure. <laughs> yeah. Is it's always going to be really, isn't it? Like this is this is the beauty of the Super League, isn't it? It's it's top players. There's not there's not a lot of wiggle room in there. You know, people aren't you aren't likely to make really dumb mistakes to just hand you the game. So it's going to be really like tight and nip and tuck, mm. unless like you know it's a bit of a dicing or whatever, or like a team mismatch. <laughs> exactly, J Five. I mean that is a problem of translating a thirty-year-old board game. I know that. I know that there's an edition in twenty twenty, but you know it's it's not much removed from the nineteen ninety-four board game, is it? Um, and you know, so we're all playing a thirty-year-old board game, and it's. Yeah, it's not it's not like Call of Duty where you can see, you know, shooting and action and things and be like, ooh, wow. 
But for us blood bowlers, it's uh, super interesting. I mean, chess doesn't look interesting, does it? To a, a... no, a chess is boring though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, but to 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 non chess enthusiasts, chess looks really uninteresting. But lots of people love it, don't they? Lots of people love fishing. Fishing's like the biggest hobby, isn't it? In in England. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And I went fishing. Good evening, Bebo. It was absolute fucking garbage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've fished a few times. Yeah, mm. I feel 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 sorry for the fish. <laughs> <laughs> well, there we go. So we've cleared him to get the to get oh, him up shit. and get him there. Be so right yeah, back. he's made lots of blocks here. Hello. Oh. Right. Okay. Right. You, you're not muted. I'll move you. Is that it? Oh, I can't move you. I can't mute you. Oh, well, but. Oh my god. Oh, right. Oh, oh god, okay, I'll move Elliot out. I'll move Elliot out. He hasn't mute himself. <laughs> oh, I'll, I'll make him, I'll add him to commentary now. That's clever, then he can move himself back. Let me in! <laughs> yeah, oh god, I can't. Why can't I move him? What the hell? Okay, I'm, 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 I'm coming to you, Elliot. Hello. Oh. <laughs> you haven't muted yourself on the that. thing, so I just had to move you out in case, you know, you said something like, yes, I'll have the drugs yeah, ready yeah, for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you want how much for this cocaine? <laughs> <laughs> you never know. You do, how you did never. you know? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. So, yeah, that was a good recovery by, uh, by Andy, wasn't it? And, you know, now Art's reduced to the move everybody in and hope for the best kind of turn here, which is, you can see by all the red circles, it's just pretty much moved in and hoping for the best. Oh, wow, yeah. Yeah, this seems like... The thing is, well, you can, like... It, it, well, maybe not at this stage, but not, you know, not in the far too too far distant future, you can start kind of falling back, right? Go, <laughs> going to the turtle, you know, go I back a few squares every turn, keep a screen, oh dear. I was just going to say, maybe you don't block there, right? Because that, that going bonehead, I didn't think of the one in nine, but I thought if that boneheads, all of a sudden, it's it's a real bad bonehead, isn't it? Wow. And uh... Yes, but he, he's so far down anyway, right? I think I'm blocking there because... We're fucked, you know. Yeah. We gotta make things happen. I think. Yeah. yeah, that's fair. Yeah, the troll is not being good, has it? <laughs> Instant regret for my troll pick. Be best matchup for the troll. <laughs> He's shit. <laughs> yeah, he loses the game single-handedly. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> I guess uh, the the blitz still has to come on the ball, or he's got a dodge of the ball yeah. carrier. Unless he can chain no, him. We I don't think we're in that bad a spot, right? We, we, we're blocking that. We're blitzing that blitz, I think. If it's me, I'm yeah. blitzing that blitz uh, and just falling back a few squares and, like, screening off on that, you know, side of the pitch, I think. Yeah, yeah, he's going to play it sensibly. But, like, if, again, if it was nil-nil, right, then maybe Andy blitzes this blitzer and then dodges away and oh, yeah. tries to do something. Oh, yeah, but... for sure. Pro yeah. Probably you do, right? Like, you know, you say, okay, you know, this is a good enough chance, you know, for me to risk the one in nine to probably win the game here. There's, there's very little if you blitz that blitzer down, isn't there, that can stop yeah. you, so... But yeah, with the situation being what it is, one 0 up. This is this is the this is the freedom that you've got for yourself by going defense first. Because yeah, if you get if you if you go defense and get scored on, well, it's changed nothing. You still have to score at all costs. <laughs> okay, he is yeah. going for it. He is going Holy for it. Flip. Oh, or maybe not. Maybe just going to block the ball carrier. Maybe just going to block the ball carrier. Uh, ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Fair. Another removal. It's funny, as much as Art's a flat dicer, and always going, he has been. He's had the worst dice, hasn't he? Two one and nines from the troll. Uh, two KO, uh, three KOs, loads of stuns. Um, yeah. He's, he definitely Holy has had shit. the worst of the dice. Does no, he's got noise. It. Oh, he's gone for the hand mean, off. Okay. That's well, a better failure state, isn't it? It is, but. I, I really don't like it because that surely that's. I, maybe, maybe not, but like, I know. I, I, I'm. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking that's like just, just you know exactly what I'm looking for as Artemis right it's like yes please give me a handoff give me a dodge you know like I, I'll take that one in nine for, for a chance at the win right now because I'm you know so far behind yeah I don't yeah. know yeah yeah no I, honestly I thought he was just going to block the ball carrier like after that bit I was like oh maybe he's just going to block the ball carrier because yeah the, the, the hand up but yeah handoff's better than the dodge that's for sure isn't it because the, the failure state is oh yeah yeah for sure I, so I that, that's just a kind of like a 
Yeah. That was me not being a level two coach there. <laughs> <laughs> Did not not dodging at the right time. <laughs> <laughs> well, you have read the rulebook, so you are no, no. So you, yeah, you're not a level two coach, right? You're a level one coach. I've read the rulebook, but then you can you can still go up after yeah. them. You can still go after them. So so for some reason he had his you, level you're zero not dodging coach. at the right time. No, no, yeah, yeah. Some level one, yeah. But <laughs> yeah, but the the level zero coaches are people who've never heard of Blood Bowl. It seems un, it seems yeah. unnecessary, doesn't it? <laughs> Oh, what is that? What a level zero coach is? Yeah, yeah, he added a level zero on, which has never heard of Blood Bowl. Oh my god! So, <laughs> wait, so I can't be a level zero coach, but I'm not a level one coach either. No, because so, level one's with the rules. So I don't know. <laughs> so what the fuck? <laughs> You're in limbo. You're shrouding his Blood Bowl coach. <laughs> 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 Who knows? Well, it's over now, isn't it? Andy has scored an arts yeah, drive. We're done. We're done. Our ones has to side, and yeah, this is this is you know, uh, it went well. <laughs> Elliot just said we're done, so I mean, flip me if that doesn't. I mean, we are, aren't we? I think we're actually. Well, okay, okay, we, we could uh, <laughs> we could score next turn, I guess, right? Um, <laughs> And and then and then Armas has two turns, so yeah, he could could still draw, couldn't he? he could still draw. Yeah. And he could get he could get a consolation touchdown to help his goal difference. Oh yeah, okay, we've, yeah, got, sure. we've got touchdown difference as a thing, but um, hmm. yeah, realistically, it's looking uh, it's looking very over. Yeah. A good game, I thought, but yeah, I mean, yeah, it's quite I cool. Think, yeah, yeah, I de definitely think Art had the, uh, Art had the worst dice. Yeah, yeah. Like not yeah. not brutally unfair, but enough. Yeah, enough to yeah. give him an edge. And then you just need a small edge to to you know for the result, don't you? At the end of the day, it's not like you know like that small edge mm -hmm. translated into not just stopping the defense, but but again, you know, if Art Art could have, you know, Art went for the score himself rather than just trying to stop it, right? If he had, if I mean, he, he also. Of, he, he took that GFI with the ball right that just exposed it. I mean, he could have. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, the, yeah if, he, if he's not getting if he's not getting sacked that turn, he's probably not conceding, right? Yeah. Yeah. True. I mean, if everything's delayed a turn, he probably doesn't concede. Yeah. Yeah. And so. and after that, he could have blitzed the guy as well. So there was a few things he could have done to not get turned over and scored on. So if he comes out and if he comes out at nil nil, then the nil the, the second half is a lot different at nil nil than at one nil, isn't it? Oh yeah, yeah. Then it's yeah. You know, I think it's probably no no to finish then, right? I, yeah. I I'm I'm gonna go with, you know, def defence is you know, more more likely to stop. Maybe that's a bit, yeah, bit much, it's, but it's maybe. funny, isn't it? It's like slivers of equity, isn't it? Like, yeah, like that really is what it is, like those those like little edge cases. Um mm -hmm. Yeah, that's do you, do you like this summary by the way? This is <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, it's good, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is the this is the summary uh, of Blood Bowl three. So you you do, uh, when you're spectating, it just doesn't just doesn't work. So yeah, it's a it's a shame that shame that such an otherwise. Uh... <laughs> Hmm. Let, well, I'll, I'll leave that one hanging for you, shall I? <laughs> such a perfect, uh, immaculate game that has a, has a problem such as this. Just it's spoiled like... by these little, yeah, you know, these little niggling problems, you know. <laughs> yeah. Uh. yeah, it is. It is. I mean, it is a shame, but but um, yeah, because but the thing, the funny thing is, like the the post match thing isn't that good anyway. <laughs> no, no, no. So no. um. <laughs> So like you're not really missing much. Like uh, the the Blood Bowl two post game thing was a lot better than the Blood Bowl three post game thing. I yeah, thought. and the Blood Bowl two one was kind of garbage. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> let's, yeah. let's be real here. <laughs> yeah. It's it's just nice to put it on after it's after it's, it's finished. It certainly it? looked a lot better. Holy yeah. shit! <laughs> yeah, exactly. How, how nice did it look? Not better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but what we do have is uh, I've made a thing here. Look at this live updated uh, updated. Oh, oh, wow, nice, nice, So there nice. we go, there's Pretty Group cool. B, yeah, we've Whoa. got Sol and Andy yeah. off to the races, 2-0 wins. Wow. number one NAF uh, NA Vats. Mmm, <laughs> and Cruz and Hiru, I mean, it's, it's funny because at the start of the game, you'd probably, you'd probably maybe bet on that being 1-1, one, one. Um, but we had, the, we had the, you know, what you talked about, defence being better, Cruz stopped Hiru's score, turned him over, but then Hiru turned over Cruz, and it, it looked a bit like, it felt, you know, like probably he's a point lost for Cruz, you know, and a point gain for Hiru. Um, yeah, I always got to feel like that, I guess, right? And then, like mm. you say, like, it, when you do turn over, then, like, you've got a big advantage in that second half, right? Yeah. Not, not having to score. 
Yeah, so there you go. That's Group B. Um, so that's a bet. That's a better thing than a running goblin, isn't it? To 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 to, to end the uh, to end the broadcast. Well, not the broadcast. The uh, YouTube video because there's another match about to start. Um, so thank oh, you very much, really? Elliot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I'm, I mean, I'm not. I'm not. You know, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I can't. I can't promise Elliot will stick around for the next one. But uh, for this one, uh, congratulations to Andy. Commiserations to Artemis. Uh, thank you very much, Elliot. A wonderful surprise having you in the booth. Oh, bye. Thank you. Sorry, I was, I was literally, I was actually genuinely drifting off there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, no, don't, don't, don't drift off. But often, when you talk to me, I like, pretend I don't say anything because I think it's funny and I'm stupid. But that time, I was actually thinking and, and like not paying attention. Yeah. <laughs> no problem. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic. <laughs>